It's Thursday night throwdown. The Jacksonville Suns and Pensacola Blue Wahoos getting set for the fourth game of the series. Welcome to Suns Today. Here's a 2-2 pitch. Berg swings. It's a high drive. That's deep in the right field. Andriel is back, but he'll watch it go over the wall. A walk-off homer for Alex Berg. First pitch to Matt Yingle is swung on. High drive deep to left field to the palm trees. It's gone. Russell swings. A fly ball. High and deep to right field. It is gone. A three-run homer. Hello again, everybody. I'm Roger Hoover, joined by Mackenzie Thurkill as we welcome you back to Bragan Field on this Thursday night throwdown. Yesterday, Mackenzie, baseball in the sunshine, a lot of kids on hand, over 5,000 for Celebration or Reading Day. Yes, it was, and it was very hot outside. There were plenty of fans being passed around, lots of kids, just like you said, Roger. Having a lot of fun in the ballpark, the Suns didn't have as much fun as Pensacola won the third game of the series by a final score of 5-1. to one. Here's a look back at all the highlights. Here's a fastball to Skipworth, swung on, a high drive deep to center field. Way back to the warning track as it falls on the base of the wall for a base hit. Waldrop scores, getting the wave around third, Mejia Green. He'll score without a play. It's a two-run double for Kyle Skipworth, and the Wahoos lead the Suns 3-0 top of the first. One-two pitch is swung on, a high fly ball that's deep into right field. Way back and gone, midway up in the bleachers. It's a two-run homer for Kyle Waldrop, and the Blue Wahoos now lead the Suns Five to nothing, top of the third. The Suns had a tough day. It's been back to back days that the Wahoos have scored three runs at the top of the first. Yesterday, the Suns left 10 men on base and only scored one run. Now, the Suns are looking to get back on track as well as many other teams. And for a full report, here's Kyle Crux. All right, thanks guys. While it is warm in Jacksonville, the action is heating up around the Southern League as we get to the Southern League scoreboard. Starting out in Birmingham last night, it was the lookout shutting out the Barons three to nothing. Jose Barrios, a complete game shutout. He moves to four and one on the year. The Shuckers top the Jackson Generals in a 14 to 10 contest. In the loss, Jabari Blash went four for five with two home runs, one of those long balls, a grand slam, and seven RBIs. Again, in a losing effort. And in the nightcap last night, it was Mississippi 8 and Mobile 5, and that game took just less than three and a half hours to play. Take a look at the Southern League standings. Starting out in the north, Chattanooga still in first place, while the Tennessee Smokies two and a half back, four and six in their last ten. And in the South Division, Biloxi still in first, while Mobile, losers of their last three, have now fallen two games back, while your Jacksonville Suns five and a half off the pace. Just two games left in the first installment of the battle for the Golden Skillet, as the Suns continue to try to creep their way up the South Division standings. We'll have more in tomorrow's edition of Suns Today as we take a look at the scoreboard and the standings as well. But for now, we send it back to Roger Hoover and Mackenzie Thurkill. Thank you, Kyle. Tonight, the Jacksonville Suns will try and even the series at two games apiece as the Suns look to one of their most consistent starting pitchers on the mound. Jacksonville will have Chipper Smith going. He's 2-0 on the season, and the lefty has really pitched well here at home at Bragan Field. He'll be opposed by Daniel Wright of Pensacola. He's trying to get his season back on track. He's 0-4 on the season. Tonight should be a lot of fun here at Bragan Field. McKenzie, it's college night, nurses night. We welcome all college students and hospital workers to the ballpark. And it also is Thursday night throwdown. It is Thursday night throwdown. So that means $1 buds all night long, as well as two for one cocktails. Should be a lot of fun and make sure you share your experience with us here on social media. How can fans do that? You can either tag us at Suns Baseball or use the hashtag never been hotter and you never know you might see your tweet get reposted. Well, we'll look out for that during the game. If you're at the ballpark, sit back and relax. We have baseball between the Suns and Blue Wahoos coming up. And if you're watching this online on the Suns YouTube channel, just head on over to jacksons.com. There you can listen to the game through the Suns Baseball Network or watch on MILB.TV. With Kyle Crooks and Mackenzie Thurkill, I'm Roger Hoover. Thanks for watching. Go Suns!